हाई गाइज माई नेम इज कौशल एंड आई एम द चीफ अकेडमिक ऑफिसर एट आई क्वांटा आप लोगों ने सुना ही होगा कि आई क्वांटा का रिजल्ट इस बार बहुत ही बेहतरीन रहा है आई क्वांटा से 200 प्लस कैट 99 प्लस परसेंटाइलर्स इस बार 2023 में रहे हैं बट हैविंग सेट दैट हमने अक्सर देखा है कि जिनका भी ज़्यादा परसेंटाइल आता है ऑन एन एवरेज या फिर कॉमनली उनका क्वांट बहुत अच्छा होता है इससे क्या होता है कि जिनका क्वांट वीक है वो स्टार्टिंग से इनसेक्योर या अंडर कॉन्फिडेंट रहते हैं कि अगर हमारा क्वांटी अच्छा नहीं है तो हमसे कैसे ही प्रिपरेशन हो पाएगा और परसेंटाइल कैसे अच्छी आएगी तो आफ्टर हैविंग एनालाइज आर प्रीवियस ईयर्स कोर्स एंड गेटिंग सम फीडबैक फ्रॉम स्टूडेंट्स हम लोगों ने रियलाइज किया कि हमारे पास एक सेपरेट प्रोडक्ट फॉर दीज स्टूडेंट्स होना चाहिए जो कि क्वांट में थोड़े से वीक है फॉर दैट वी हैव लॉन्च नॉन इंजीनियरिंग मॉड्यूल इसमें बेसिकली क्या होगा आपके सिक्स टू टेंथ की मैथ्स के एनसीआर कवर की जाएगी सो दैट यू स्टार्ट फ्रॉम अ कॉमन बैटल ग्राउंड विद दीज पीपल जिनका क्वांट ऑलरेडी डिसेंट लेवल पे स्ट्रॉग है ये कैसा प्रोडक्ट दिखता है इसका मैं एक रफ डेमो इस वीडियो में डालने वाला हूँ वो आप चेकआउट करिए एंड हैव अ लुक हर सो वेलकम टू द स्पेशल session by iquanta we are going to have some concept builder lessons here so uh, if you have any of the math phobia now avoid it you are going to miss it because we are going to remove all math phobia all type of math fear from every one of you now we are starting with the first topic which is number system now number system is an integral part of cat and all other mb entrance exams in itself it is a topic of cat and beyond that in all other topics be it geometry algebra or modern maths we find an affuse of number system everywhere so we are beginning with the first topic that is simply classification of numbers so in our schools we have studied various types of numbers so quickly we are going to have a recap of all those things so first variety of numbers is natural numbers so natural numbers they are also known as positive integers they are denoted by the capital letter n and examples we have 1 2 3 and so on all these numbers they are known as natural numbers they are also called counting integers or counting numbers so as i said the common term for these numbers is positive integers so whenever we are counting anything we always start our counting from number 1 then 2 then 3 then 4 and so on like if i ask you uh, how many students were there in your class so you will start counting from 1 only 1 2 3 and so on how many fingers do you have again 1 2 3 4 and so on we won't say that uh, minus 1 minus 2 or 1 by 2 1 by 3 like that so all other fractions or negative numbers they are other than that so our basic counting that starts from this counting numbers which are known as natural numbers that is our first category so this is the easiest one and most of the questions in all the exams we find based on this natural numbers only so we'll be discussing more about that in our further lesson now let's move forward to the next next category it is whole numbers now whole numbers includes all these natural numbers starting from 1 2 3 and so on but other than that there is a special number that is zero so that is also included in this set of whole numbers the symbol for that is capital letter w and as we said natural numbers to be positive integers these whole numbers are also known as non negative integers now here very important point is there to note that uh, why i am saying non negative is it uh, is it not that non negative means positive no so there is slight difference and you can very easily find out the difference the difference is of this number zero now see on this number line we have zero and towards the right of zero we are having all the positive numbers 1 2 3 4 and so on and on the left side of zero we are having all negative numbers so basically we need to understand what is the meaning of positive and negative so when i'm saying positive so and negative so positive means the numbers which are on the left 
for positive the numbers which are on the right side of zero that means the numbers which are more than zero or greater than zero so the numbers which are greater than zero they are called positive similarly the numbers which are on the left side of zero on the number line that is which are less than zero they are termed as negative but again what about zero so zero is the deciding factor zero is neither positive nor negative so zero is the deciding factor now because in this set of whole numbers we have included zero so this complete set of numbers is not positive now because positive uh, for it to be positive it has to be more than zero which was the case in natural numbers so whole numbers is the set of non negative integers that means except in negative integers all other integers they are termed as set of whole numbers i hope this thing is clear to you and with this addition let's introduce one more term i can also talk about non positive integers can you think of non positive integers so when i'm saying non positive integers so which integers i'm looking for so non positive integers means except positive integers all other integers that means this set will include uh, all the negative integers that is minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and so on and it will include 0 also because 0 is also not positive right and after 0 we are going to have positive integers so I'm leaving those positive integers now this complete set will be known as set of non positive integers like whole numbers we are not having a symbol for this but this is also a category so generally in the questions in the exams we find these terms positive integers or non negative integers in place of natural numbers or whole numbers so we must be familiar with all these terms I hope this is clear so far let's move further to the next category so the next category of numbers is integers so which is quite obvious now uh, integers will include all these natural numbers that is positive integers that is 1 2 3 and so on it will include 0 and it will include negative of integers also that is minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and so on so this complete set of numbers so that will be called set of integers now symbol for this integers is z now note one important thing here uh, i have put dots uh, in all these brackets for natural numbers whole numbers as well as integers what does it mean it clearly means that there is no last number there are infinite many natural numbers there are infinite many whole numbers there is a smallest natural number there is a smallest whole number there is the largest known positive integer but in case of integers when we are talking about there are there is no smallest integer and there is no largest integer total number of integers are infinite right one more thing before we go forward uh, what is the number of integers between any two particular integers for example if i take one integer as this minus 3 and other integer is let's say 2 so these are two particular integers on this number line so can you calculate how many integers lie between these two integers when i'm using the term between that means i'm excluding these two so between these two integers except these two integers how many more integers are there in between so it's clearly 1 2 3 and 4 right so whatever two particular integers i select there is always going to be finite number of integers between them right now tell me is it possible that between any two integers there is no more integer what will be the situation yes that is possible so when there is no integer between any two particular integers they are known as consecutive integers so that is also a very important term and in many questions we find this term consecutive integers to we'll study more about this in further uh, lessons but for now we can understand that consecutive integers are two integers in which there in between which there is no more integer can you tell me what will be the difference yes the difference between two consecutive integers is always going to be one so if a and b are two consecutive integers such that a is more than b so clearly a minus b is going to be equal to 1 right so very easily we can see say 0 and 1 they are two consecutive integers because there is no integer between them and their gap is 1 their difference is 1 3 4 or 4 5 or minus 2 minus 1 and so on 
ओके लेट्स प्रोसीड फॉरवर्ड आई होप आपको ये वीडियो अच्छा लगा होगा बट दिस इज जस्ट अ पार्ट ऑफ द मेनी वीडियोज दट वी कैन पुट इन योर डैशबोर्ड अगर आप कैट 2024 कोर्स बाय आईकॉन्टा में एनरोल्ड है जैसे कि हमारे बहुत सारे स्टूडेंट जो कि ऑलरेडी एनरोल कर चुके हैं इस चीज़ का फायदा उठा रहे हैं एंड इफ यू आर समवन जिसको लगता है कि उसकी क्वांट वीक है उतनी स्ट्रॉग नहीं है या इफ यू आर फीलिंग अंडर कॉन्फिडेंट इन जनरल और आपको लगता है कि कोई एक जगह होती जहाँ पे आप अपना बेसिक्स ब्रशअप कर पाते दिस इज द राइट प्लेस इफ यू हैव एनी फर्दर क्वेरीज अराउंड द कोर्स या फिर एनी इन जनरल दिस इज द नंबर वेर यू कैन कॉल एंड आस एनी क्वेरीज एंड कंसर्न दैट यू माइट हैव Thank you so much for watching all the best